the big bottle was eight dollars. Eight dollars. Hey y'all, it's me. I'm back with another video. Okay, so um, this is just about to be a, get, a little get ready with me. I'm not going anywhere, but <laughs> actually I am going somewhere. But I'm not like going out or nothing like that. But y'all are going to get ready with me. So, um, yeah, if you're new here, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And to become part of the gang, you know what I'm saying? We growing over here. The fuck? We growing? I almost got 100 subscribers, which is crazy. I'm two subscribers away from 100. Uh, just last year, I had, last year around this time, I think I had, like, I probably like 40, 20 subscribers. I'm not sure. So, I'm very excited about that. But, yeah, y'all, so, I'm just about to get ready. I'm about to chunk a wig on like i ain't about to it's i'll show y'all but y'all um let, let's talk while i'm getting ready so disappointed i'm so disappointed in myself because i really 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 wanted to do the baddest takeover uh kind of if you haven't been watching my videos if this your first video my birthday was february 8th so the month the whole month of february i wanted to do this thing called the baddest takeover um, where I like basically it's like vlog vlogmas, but for my birthday month. But February is not over, y'all. Don't even, don't even. I'm shaving tonight. But February, February is almost over with. Um, we got like a week left, and that's cool. You know, I'm still gonna go up. My mom bought me this week. Uh, if I could find, I'm pretty sure, I think this was white, like one of, the, it, this is a synthetic wig, y'all, because I am not going to be wearing this hair that long, I just want to do something fun, so, um, this was a white wig, and then she used red dye to dye it, this color, so, yeah, but if y'all want the link, so y'all can try to get a color like this, or y'all can dye your own wig, me, I don't like wearing colors that long. I'm not a person that will wear color wig. I probably will. I don't want to wear a color wig for like <clears throat> seven days or not even, not even seven days. So I like uh, wearing synthetic color wigs because I'm not going to wear it that long. And I don't want to spend my money on a wig that I'm only going to wear for like three days. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, this little old bottle was $2.99. They must say $2.99. The big bottle, we went to the, I went to the beauty supply yesterday. The big bottle, just to get this, the big bottle was $8. $8 each year for my birthday. I always end up, well, since I was 19, I always end up drunk. So I always make like a video to my, uh, to bring in the new year. So I made a video, cheers to 21. I am 21. Um, and I feel as though 20, my 21st year is about growing and maturing. So, I try to take myself out of the situation. I try to take my emotions out of the situations. Now, it's all, it hasn't even been a month since I'm 21, but I feel I can, this is what I'm working on. You know what I'm saying? Being more mature, being, being able to actually converse with people and explain to people my feelings and my emotions because I, I, I hate the fact that I'm misunderstood. You know what I'm saying? Like even my, some of my family don't even like, I'm misunderstood by a lot of people. And I always used to put that blame on other people. Like y'all don't understand me. Y'all don't understand me. Y'all don't understand me. But now I feel as though I'm taking responsibility and I'm trying if people are willing, you know what I'm saying? If the people that's close to me willing to get to know me, then I'm trying to help people or teach people who I am. You know what I'm saying? Because it'd be a lot of assumptions and stuff like that. I don't clear up rumors. So like I'll let somebody think whatever they want to think. You don't know me. You know what I'm saying? So I know me, but that's still not that's still not good. You know what I'm saying? That's still not good. I want pe I want people to get to know me and all that stuff. Cause I don't want nobody like and when I'm not around, I don't know what people will say about me. That and that's what scared me. About to do my eyebrows. I know this is a weird angle, but it's a little talc. But uh this pencil, if y'all wanna know, I don't be this pencil is by Velour. Is that how you say that? V Velour. 
I think, the, yeah, the Lord. Uh, it got the pencil right here. I actually love this pencil. I got this from Ulta. Uh, it got the spoolie, and then down here, this is a, a brow balm, but I don't use that one. So, yeah, so it's like, it's just certain stuff like that, but... I mean, my birthday is over with. I am 20. I'm still 21 though. So you know what I'm saying. Every day I wake up and I'm and every day I wake up I'm celebrating my 21st birthday. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm still 21 and I'm just trying to make it to the next year. So that's that. And it was just like um this year I really I tried to have like a big celebration because of my business. Oh yeah, y'all. I forgot to show y'all, but. Y'all see my dress? This dress is from my website. I mean, from my business, Simply K. If you don't know, uh, sorry, y'all. By the time y'all see this video, um, it should... By the time y'all see this video, my website should be up. So, click the link down below and shop and support your girl. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we haven't... We bring in more, more, more things. Uh, I have a clear and concise vision for my business, and I'm so ready to execute it. You know what I'm saying? So that, and that's crazy because this year, um, for my birthday, I wanted to drop on my birthday. Uh, I couldn't do that. So next time I know, if I want to drop before my birthday, I really have to have everything done a month before my birthday. So um, that's cool though, but I'm still dropping in February, so the best takeover is still going on. I'm gonna speak on some positivity and to, cause the only thing I gotta do is put my lashes on after this. But my business class is supposed to, today is Sunday the 21st. Yeah, today's Sunday the 21st. Business cards are supposed to come, um, my business cards and my hand text is supposed to come yesterday. But if y'all didn't know, I am in Texas and we had this like little snowstorm. When the storm, people was without power, people was out uh, heat, uh, water, all that. So they was like, it was a backup because of that. But hopefully, my son, I want to relaunch on Monday. I mean, on Wednesday. So hopefully, my um my business cards come by then and all that stuff. So so excited. Like, I'm excited to relaunch this one, and I'm like, I'm just so excited to relaunch my business, you know what I'm saying? Start back orders and all this stuff. I've, I've learned a lot um, with the first time, like, when I first dropped in, like, 2019, I learned a lot since then, and I know it's more so about consistency. Uh, to me, that's where I've been, like, consistency, consistency, consistency. That's what life is about. You can't, you're not going to see, see results if you're not consistent. You know what I'm saying? You, and that, and putting your all into it. So, I feel as though if you put your all into it and you're consistent and you don't get the results that you want, then it's time to move on. But a lot of the times, hold on, yeah. A lot of the times, people don't even, a lot of the times, people are not consistent and people don't put the hard work in. So, you don't know if it's for you or not because you ain't even put all your effort in and that's me that's me i was i was one of those so even like with school and stuff like that like i was not putting my all into school and i was still i'm skating y'all like this gonna sound bad but this i'm real if you're new here and or if you just started watching me and stuff like that i know i'm a new a uh, newer youtuber and all that stuff but i i want to be transparent like any platform that I have, Instagram, any platform, when I, if I get me a television show, which I think I need one, any platform I have, I have to be transparent. Like, I'm going to be for real with y'all. I'm not about to act like something that I'm not. But, like, even with school, like, a and is a hard school. a and is a prestigious school. a and is a ranked school. You know what I'm saying? But I'm in this mud doing a bare minimum. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing a bare minimum and I'm getting bare minimal results. Like, I'm not even gonna bullshit y'all. Like, I ain't flunked out. <laughs> I ain't flunked out. And that's what, and that's what, like, that's what opened my eyes. That I'm in this much skating in, at a and at a prestigious school and I ain't flunked out yet. That means if I do my all, if I actually work hard and all that stuff, then, oh, Dean's List? Yeah, that's what I may have to, that's where I have to give myself a reality check and all that stuff because I'm literally not putting, I don't, but I'm going to be honest with y'all, in school, 
out especially like with this online stuff i probably tell you i'm putting it in like bro this one sounds so bad but i'm probably putting in like 25 percent effort and that's no cap me putting 25 percent of the effort and i'm getting the results down and i'm still doing it i don't never try to compare myself to anybody else so i don't know like i'm still doing better than everybody else because i don't know how everybody else doing in school you know what i'm saying but me i'm still doing okay that's what i'm saying i'm doing okay i'm doing average in school and i only put 25 percent effort in so if i put 100 percent nigga even if i put 50 percent if I put 50%, then I'll be a great student. Or if I put 100%, then nigga, what? Give me my, give me my diploma. Go ahead. Go ahead and sit right here. You know what I'm saying? So, like, and I always, like, me talking to certain people. Like, I was talking to this dude, and he's from Florida. And it was just, it opened my eyes. And it also showed me that I am, um, that I, uh, I'm overlooking my blessings because he was telling me like how he was so grateful, so proud to get into A&M and all that stuff because it's not where he come from. People, niggas not going to A&M. Shit, where I come from, niggas not going to A&M. You know what I'm saying? Well, they are now, but it's not a lot of people where I come from, y'all, where I come from, where people is either even going to school, let alone a PWI. People like us going to a PWI know where when I was in school, when I was in school, nigga, 85, 95% of the class was black. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I was like, dang, when he, we was talking about it and all this stuff. And I'm like, dang, I'm in this one really like mishandling my blessings and stuff like that. Because this is a blessing nonetheless. I automatically got in because I was in the top 10%. But I don't under, I haven't, I don't understand. And I haven't, I haven't, I don't understand. And I haven't seen People in this month grinding, 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 they get to a &M because I just walked in this month because I was that good in high school or I was that smart in high school, you know what I'm saying? And I don't never want to misuse my blessing and all this stuff because it's probably somebody that want my spot, you know what I'm saying? And I have to show God and I have to show myself that this my spot. Can't nobody take it. I deserve to be here. None of that. You know what I'm saying? So that's like I've been having to motivate myself it been kind of weird i don't know why it felt so forced and weird it still feel forced and weird but i've been having to motivate myself and push myself talk to myself y'all bro i be having conversations i don't know about y'all but i be having conversations with myself with myself in my head like no cap i be having to talk to myself bitch you got this da 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 da, da. like don't yeah like i be having to do that like and that's okay it's motivating me a lot it's motivating me a lot. It's motiv it's pushing me, and uh, I feel as like, though so this is a part of my um. I don't think this is the right pencil, but we'll see. Uh, I think this is a. Uh, it's not, but I can make it hurt. But yeah, what I was saying was, I think that the I don't know what I was saying, but I think that this is a part of like my self care, my self love journey, and stuff like that. Me loving myself, I gotta hold myself accountable. You know what I'm saying? I I asked God, and I said this in my last video. If you haven't watched, you need to go watch it. I'm gonna link. The, I'm gonna put the link down below. But I t I sat down and I prayed to God, and I asked God to reveal my flaws, reveal any characteristics that that is not serving me, reveal any anything that is not that I don't need or anything that I need to share or detox from myself to become the woman that I know that the woman that I know that I'm going to be the woman that he created me to be you know what I'm saying that's why I ask God so I'm, I'm prideful I'm for I'm this is my first time I'm in it but I am prideful I am prideful as fuck and pride is gonna like pride is a, a deadly sin so Pride is one of the seven deadly sins. So that's why I've been working on trying to take my pride out of the situation. Trying to, in any situation, trying to find that ego and saying, shut up. This ain't got nothing to do with you. You know what I'm saying? And that's where I feel as though that's where I'm moving to. And that's where I have shifted my perspective to. And I can feel myself like, I'm not perfect, y'all. I'm not perfect, but I can feel myself growing and that's what i like like shedding all of that negative shit so i can bring some new shit is and growing that's what i feel like i'm doing i feel it
almost done. I just gotta put my last lash on. So let me go ahead and put my lash on so we can close this video out. I hope I did motivated somebody. I hope I didn't gave y'all some something. I hope somebody took something from this. And I just went in this little rambling. This lash fucked up. <laughs> Did y'all see that? You yeah, know, I'm about to start crying. Ooh. Okay, y'all. So, hold on. Um, all right, y'all. This is the end of the video. Um, if you made it this far, thank you so much. Um, I hope I motivated somebody. I hope I gave y'all some words of wisdom. Um, anything. I hope I did something. I hope I just wasn't in here rambling for real, y'all. But thank you so much if you watched this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Share this video with anybody, everybody. Stay blessed and stay positive. Peace.